Mantis shrimp use a powerful spring-loaded appendage to pummel their prey. And now, scientists have discovered that the crustaceans start throwing down less than two weeks after hatching. In a new study, scientists collected larval mantis shrimp from the waters of Hawaii. They scooped some larvae out of the open ocean, luring them into buckets with bright lights. And they also snagged a clutch full of eggs that they transported to their lab and raised for about a month. In observing the larvae, they found that the youngsters start striking and waving with their so-called raptorial appendages between day 9 and 14 after hatching. These raptorial appendages are basically their boxing gloves. At this point in their development, each larva is about the size of a grain of rice, and the crustaceans start swimming around in the water and gobbling down live prey in the form of larval brine shrimp. They found that, in terms of speed, the larval shrimp threw punches an order of magnitude slower than their lightning-fast parents, whose ballistic strikes can reach speeds between 40 and 50 miles per hour. That said, in terms of how quickly the larvae transitioned from stillness to striking, they were fairly on par with adult shrimp. Despite being slower than the adults, for a creature the size of a rice grain, the larvae still pack quite a punch. In fact, the larvae still threw punches that were five to 10 times faster than the reported swimming speeds of similarly sized organisms, and more than 150 times faster than their favorite brine shrimp snacks can swim. In future studies, the team plans to look closer at why larval mantis shrimp are slower than the adults and how their speed changes throughout development. Little is known about larval mantis shrimp in general, so many mysteries remain to be solved. <laughs> <laughs>